Hi there. It was 100 years ago on May 22nd, 1915 that a vigorous eruption on Lassen Peak shot gas, ash, and pumice about 30,000 feet into the air. That column collapsed to form a pyroclastic flow which tore down the mountain to where I'm standing today. We now call that area the devastated area. Today, you can tour this area to see the resiliency of life and how the forest has recovered in the last 100 years. You can also see the lava bombs that fell here during that historic eruption, and this banded pumice, which formed on May 22nd, 1915 at 4.30 p.m. It's not too often that we know the exact date that a rock was made. Come and join Lassen Volcanics staff and scientists from the U.S. Geological Survey to help celebrate the centennial of this historic eruption over the Memorial Day weekend. Special events for the eruption begin on the afternoon of May 22nd and go through the morning of Monday, May 25th. These special events include a uh, commemoration of the eruption at the exact moment that the eruption occurred. We also have campfire talks with geologists where you can learn about the volcanoes here in the park, walking tours of our hydrothermal areas like sulfur works, and constellation tours with rangers at night. Check the park webpage for a schedule of events to celebrate the eruption centennial. It should be a blast. Earlier this month, the park hosted a bike, run, and walk event on the main park road before it was open for the summer season. Hundreds of people from as far away as Germany came to enjoy a sunny spring day on the park road. The following day, the Lassen National Park Highway, the main road that connects Highway 89 through the park, was open for the summer season. This was one of the earlier openings in park history. Typically, the road doesn't open until mid to late June, or sometimes after the 4th of July if it's a heavy snow year. Even though the road is open, many of the trails at higher elevations are still snow covered. An ice axe and crampons, or skins with skis, are necessary to reach the summit of Lassen Peak. Crews finished restoration work on the Lassen Peak Trail last fall, which means it'll be open to the summit all summer long. The Bumpus Hell Trail, which leads to one of the park's more popular hydrothermal areas, is closed right now on account of snow, and most likely won't open until sometime in June. However, there are other hydrothermal areas in the park that are very easily accessible at this time of year. The Sulphur Works along the main park road is very easy to see right now, and the Devil's Kitchen in the Warner Valley offers a good alternative hike to the Bumpus Hell Trail. Currently, the Southwest Walk-In Campgrounds next to the Komiwani Visitor Center are the only established campgrounds that are open in the park. The Manzanita Lake Campgrounds will be opening on Friday, May 22nd for the Memorial Day weekend. All other campgrounds here at Lassen Volcanic will be opening sometime in June. Be sure to visit our website, www.mps.gov lavo for information on ranger-led programs, campgrounds, and current conditions.